Item Number SCP-5980 Object Class Euclid Special Containment Procedures SCP-5980 is to be contained within a standard humanoid containment cell at Site-83. SCP-5980 does not require sustenance. SCP-5980 is allowed outside of its containment cell once per day for two hours for recreational activities, but is strictly prohibited from entering the cafeteria. Food offered by SCP-5980 should be declined by personnel in order to maintain their mental health. SCP-5980 is the designation given to Ethan Chin, age 33. SCP-5980 is capable of perfect cellular regeneration and is, by definition, biologically immortal. Given the regenerative properties of SCP-5980 cells, research into utilizing SCP-5980 for medicinal treatment is currently underway. Extensive testing of samples taken from SCP-5980's body has revealed that its skin, as well as its organs, nerves, and fingernails, possess a flavor that is universally enjoyed by those that consume it. The flavor of SCP-5980 will vary depending on the consumer. SCP-5980 exhibits a pleasant aroma regardless of the seasoning it's cooked with. SCP-5980 is amicable and will often encourage Foundation personnel to quote, have a bite unquote, of it when they pass by. It is important to note that SCP-5980 does not exhibit any cognitohazardous properties. Consumption of SCP-5980, while safe, is often detrimental to a subject's mental health. Discovery SCP-5980 was discovered after several complaints were made in an establishment called Cannibal Chins in northern New Jersey. A food critic claimed to have witnessed SCP-5980 remove its fingers with a kitchen knife before deep-frying them. These were later served as french fries. Several other civilians claimed to have caught glimpses of SCP-5980 self-mutilating in the kitchen moments before serving them food, and a Foundation investigation was instigated. When questioned, SCP-5980 claimed to have no idea what it was doing wrong, and insisted that Foundation operators have a complimentary order off of the menu. Its requests were denied by all attending agents except for Agent B Agent B who was unaware of SCP-5980's anomalous properties, consumed the entirety of an order of fries, size large, dipping each fry in a dark green milkshake. Agent B was psychologically evaluated and later requested an amnestic, and for his name to be expunged from the official record. SCP-5980 willingly came into Foundation custody once apprehended. Cannibal Chins was shut down using Cover Story 14 health and safety violation after four years of continuous operation. Interview 5980.4 Interviewer Dr. Owen Andrews Interviewee SCP-5980 Tell me again what you were doing at the restaurant. Growing food gets expensive, like, the cost was way too steep, man. I wish it didn't have to be that way, but when life gives you lemons… Right, of course. Did you try the finger fries? I'm afraid not. SCP-5980 holds out a finger. Tastes just like chicken, I swear. Mm -mm -mm. Have a bite, doesn't hurt. Um, no thanks. I've had something to eat already. Suit yourself, man. You're missing out. How exactly did you make the items on the menu? Oh, that's easy. I crank up the heat real high if the water's run low and I keep all my spare meat and shit in the cooler. God, I think I'd die if I made every order at once. And what did people say to you when they found out that you were the source of their meals? Eh, forget about it. I didn't do nothing wrong. They're just a bunch of unappreciative bastards is all. That'll be all for now. Addendum 5980.3 The following is a list of items found on the menu of Cannibal Chins. Meat Burger Small 465 Medium 596 Large 782 Finger Fries Small 199 Medium 299 Large 399 Lemonade 399 
Chin Special Chocolate $5 Water Free Inside Out Milkshake Small $3.99 Medium $4.99 Large $5.99 Available in Chocolate, Mint, Vanilla, and Strawberry